The garden's not gonna last all year. Oh, you scared me. He's hungry. Guess he knows the feeding time. Are you feeding those things? I feel bad for it. Yeah, of course. well, at least we found a way for him to be useful. You know, uh, her sister said she wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best, but it's really not. <laughs> I know, Becca wait. This is far from an easy life, Roman. You know what I mean. She needs to know the sacrifices we have to make to survive in this world. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. What's that one eating? I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out front. Looking forward to that soup. Probably like a rat or something. Is it somebody you know? Ugh. Oh, she's an old lady. You gotta talk to them. You have food in your hand, bro. Chill. Dick move. Don't ever fucking do that again. Whoa, what's your problem? I do this all the time. You don't get all pissed off. Just leave me alone. Oh god. Are you alright, sis? Yeah, I just just you, you caught me. You caught me at a bad time. That's all. Bad time? What's up? It's the walkers. I guess they got a hold of a puppy. Oh. A puppy? Yeah. I guess it just got to me. You know, it was, it was so little. You don't think about babies anymore, but after a while you just kind of accept this is it. Yeah. I guess you kind of forget. <laughs> you should never forget. But then, you know, it is. You see it, and you want to protect it, and, and now it's gone. That's it. It's a nice illusion because his sister growing up. Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better watchdog anyway. Becca. Shell, Becca, something's going on outside. What is it? I don't know. Something bad. We gotta find Roman. I don't know who Clive is.